right, now this is a lot of stuff. I paid $59.99 and it was originally $179.99 and they had a coupon for that price. Now, I have talked to a few people and $69.99 is about the price you're supposed to pay in the first place. So, it seems like Phantom Fireworks may be overcharging. I do not buy fireworks very often, so I'm not quite sure. But what I can tell you is the Phantom Fireworks that I went to, um, they were shorthanded. It wasn't very busy, but um, not not a whole lot of help. Uh, I would um, recommend Fireworks Supermarket, I think, if you're in the Tennessee, Georgia line area. Um, it wasn't the, the best fireworks buying experience. It seemed like everything was pretty expensive and I don't like to haggle so I I didn't really like Phantom Fireworks or at least that Phantom Fireworks so just a heads up anyway let's get into it <laughs> Thank you. 
is a lot of stuff. You know, for 70 bucks, it's really not that bad. But if you were to pay full price, I guess you're getting ripped off. I mean, there's, there's coupons all over the internet. So, um, when you're firework shopping this year, really do your research and try not to pay full price and uh, I also bought a it's not reloadable mortar and artillery shells or shells uh, it, it's all connected but there was a promotion for Father's Day that uh, $150 reloadable was for 50 and when I got there I asked about something else uh, they were shells but it was more like a one-time light and 72 shot and it was a hundred and fifty but since it wasn't the reloadable it didn't count towards the towards the coupon but she gave it to me anyway so it helps to talk and be nice and ask uh, like I said, I don't like to haggle, but uh, you can save some money by doing it. Um, you know, they, they make quite a bit of money on these fire on this firework stuff. So uh, try not to pay full price or look for as many coupons as you can online uh, because most of the time they're just going to say, okay, and you can save a lot of money. Try not to get ripped off. Okay, thanks for watching, and I hope this helps. And like I said, um, if you're in the Atlanta area trying to find a place to buy decent fireworks, Tennessee, uh, I would go just a little farther than the Phantom right there uh, on exit 1B once you get into Tennessee. And I would go to the fireworks uh, superstore or something like that. Um, I don't know. The vibe was just weird. So that's my opinion. And I hope all of these shoot off well. And I hope everyone has a fantastic 2014 4th of July.